Hey everybody, I'm Jeff Teague with Auto Jeff Reviews. This one gets 50 miles a gallon. Let's build a case for this one here. 50 miles a gallon, looks fantastic, loaded with safety, technology, lots of multimedia capabilities, and it's priced around $30,000. 2024 Hyundai Elantra Hybrid. This is the limited. Hyundai offers two different trim levels for the Elantra Hybrid. We've got the blue trim level. That's 26,250, and this one here, the limited and it's 29,450. They're both plus delivery. So this one with carpet mats was about 30,800. What a deal, but what does it look like inside? I don't know if the interior is the best part, but it sure is one of them because look at this. It looks fantastic. It's very spacious. My wife and I both agreed that it's more spacious than we thought. And by the way, thank you to Hyundai USA for letting us use this one for the week. 10.25 inch matching screens. Okay, I'm starting to think this is a good deal. Look at the room in the back seat. All right, Jeff, I'm starting to pick up what you're laying down. What makes this thing go? Well, we've got a 1.6 liter four cylinder engine with a 32 kilowatt electric motor, lithium ion battery. And I'll tell you what, this is a good looking, well organized engine compartment, isn't it? Oh yeah, it's a hybrid, that's right. This would be a vehicle that you want to consider. It drives really smooth. The acceleration is better than you think. It could be. And it gives you 139 combined horsepower. More fast facts. Ground clearance, 5.5 inches. Are you too good for your home? Why don't you go home? Whew. More performance fast facts. We've got four wheel disc brakes, 11 inches here, 10.3 inches here. McPherson strut suspension with coil springs in the front, independent multi-link suspension in the back. Woo, that's a lot. And the transmission is a six speed eco shift dual clutch transmission. But I think the reason you might be here is the MPG. Yeah, you know me. This one averages 50 MPG. You'll see the fuel door on the driver's side, 11 gallon fuel tank. It gets 49 in the city, 52 on the highway, 50 combined. Now, if you want 54 MPG instead of the limited, you might want to consider the blue trim level. This front end is really something. And one of the cornerstone pieces for this big, huge refresh with so many different changes. Look at the turn signal as it flashes. Dual projector LED headlights here. Look, we've got functional air that goes through there. That is amazing. Front parking sensors, so many different safety features. Look at the body color down below. That is gorgeous. And I love the two design, the top and the lower. Now look at these LED daytime running lights. They swing all the way across. They're thinner this year and they're separated by this metal strip. What a front end. It comes together like a shark right there at the front grill. That's a good looking profile, my friends. Look at the two-tone gray and silver 17-inch wheel design. And I love this line here. It's so pronounced. It really makes for an aggressive body line. And you think, wow, that's amazing until you see this one right here. Look at that. Woo. I feel like I'm in an art museum looking at Nouveau Modern. That is sleek. Look at that. Wow. That's really incredible. I love it. It's got turn signal indicators and the side mirror. Matte black down here, body color. This is fluid metal, by the way. And then look at this. Ooh, blind spot monitor right there. She blinded me with science. Moonroof. I see it black around the windows. It has auto lock and unlock on the front doors. And as we come around here, look at this design here. We got a diamond pattern. It's cool. The diamond back Hyundai Elantra. Wow. I love this line right here. It gives it a very wide stance. And this is the new H design for the tail lights. If you look, H, H, H. Pretty neat, right? Backup sensors, the hybrid, of course. Elantra written out there. I love the Hyundai symbol. This is the camera. And then this right here, we open her up and see all this space, including a shirt that I'll be wearing in the next video. Very wide trunk space. We've got the pull pin so that if you want to pull something really long, you can push those through. Put that in there. Nice. One thing we will find is it's the tire inflation kit, the repair kit, but it doesn't have a spare tire per se. Look, my shirt's hiding. Okay. 
This is very nice. I like the space. Hey, look at that. Did you think I'd put the seats down? I did. Holla. So we've got a little bit of an incline here, but relatively flat. So dogs could sit there, maybe on a dog pillow or dog blanket. Lots of room and look how much room there is to put something long through here and wide. That's really impressive. I see top latches. That's nice, the O bleep handles, the moonroof. Look at the different texture on this. We've got the fabric here and then the H check h Tex seats. Say it, Jeff. So it's a synthetic leather. To me, it's very comfortable. Oh, this is so spacious inside. Let's open this up to see. Nice, I like that right there. Solid, chunky, got cup holders. Big bottle holders right here. That's nice, maybe put a phone here. I like the soft touch panel. It's really cool. This is very luxury, incredible luxury actually. For the price, look at the two USB-Cs, child safety latches. Overall, I really like this interior from the backseat perspective. What about in the front? Now, since refueling, I've only added 1.8 miles. So let's be fair, if this 47.3, that's what I've been getting since I got here. I see memory seats here, but remember the MPG is supposed to average about 50. So usually creators and journalists when we test drive these things, we wanna test the acceleration. So the gas mileage might go down a little bit versus what you have projected. We'll see how it goes for me. Do I see Bose premium sound in this? I sure do. Soft touch panel that sweeps all the way across. I will tell you what, Hyundai styling the last several years, it's really improved. It looks so nice. Again, it's a tremendous value. Same thing as the Kia brand. Bose speakers, I like the space. Bottle opening, but also a little bit more. And then look at this right here. We've got illumination going all the way across. That looks sharp. 10.25 inch screen matching a 10.25 inch screen. I love the use of the gray with the dark charcoal and black. A little handle to kind of separate it, but it's modern. Do we have a power passenger seat? No, we don't. And I'm not sure I necessarily expect it on this vehicle. And it does not have the pump to raise and lower it, but I love the seat pattern. The seat design, it's very comfortable. Got nice bolstering here. The driver gets a few more perks than passenger, as you'd imagine. Memory seats, that's for the side mirrors and for the driver's seat, which is eight-way power adjustable with two-way lumbar support so we can go up, down, and it does it pretty quickly. Ooh, rise, Lord Vader, rise. Ah, 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 do you know the power of the dark side? I know the power of this vehicle, it's great. What a value for what it is. So that's a Bose system right there, eight premium speakers, leather wrapped steering wheel. Let's test out the horn. Okay, we did that. <laughs> it's done. Look at the illumination. Goes down, I like this display here. It's customizable. So we did that through here, like that. Pretty easy to use controls and to figure out. I've got voice commands right here. Like for example, I could push it and say Sirius XM. Sirius XM channel eight. Now listening to Sirius X eight. And then it would go to Sirius XM, which is right there. I just don't have it on that screen. So I would go to radio. And then we see that we've got crowded house. Hey now, hey now, don't dream it's over. And this right here, I'm seeing, wow, look at that. I can fit a deep cup in here, whatever the brand you choose. It fits in there so nicely. Now that is smart. Actually, that's kind of a bold risk to take. Kind of deep in this compartment, not super deep, but kind of deep. Here I see auto brake hold, electronic parking brake, parking sensors in the drive modes. What kind of drive modes would we anticipate if we push this? Well, let's come on over here, get it into focus, and then we're gonna find sport mode, smart mode, eco mode. Which one do you want? If I'm getting this one, I'm getting the best gas mileage possible. Let's look through some of these. We're scrolling through the... Okay, let's go across to another one. So many different fa uh, safety features. Tire pressure, I like that. Here's our adaptive cruise control, the lane centering, the lane keeping. That's all right here. 
so we could easily push that. Smart cruise control conditions not met. I just wanna show you what it's like when we set this up. I love that it has dual temperature controls, heated and cooled seats. Remember, this is the Elantra Hybrid that goes for 30,800. That's pretty amazing. Would it surprise you that it has cooled seats? And it's blowing out quite a bit right now on my back, my lower back. I like that. It's not just down below, it's the back too. That's cool. It's cool in Jeffrey's back. Yep. Got this right here. And then that controls where the air comes out. We've got dual temperature controls. Beautiful. And USBs down here. Got a USB A and a USB C 12 volt circular. So there's connectivity. That's important here. I love this illuminated strip here. That's pretty impressive. 10.25 inch. Look at all this. We can do hybrid controls. 47.3 right now. The energy flows. It tells us when we're using electric power, gasoline. How about do we go to something like setup vehicle? Here's where we're going to see some safety features, convenience features. Look, driving convenience. Highway driving assist. Stop the video and read on your own. Speed limit assist. Again, stop the video and read on your own if you want to. Warning method. How do you want to be warned? Driver attention warning. Alerts the driver during a stop when the leading vehicle departs. So if this car, and we've all seen it, if that car goes and I'm sitting here to like, do, 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 hey, it'll give you an award, or award. It'll probably give you a non-award. It'll give you a warning saying, hey, time to go. You're not paying attention, bro. Exit safely. So that provides a warning when approaching vehicles detected in the vehicle's blind spot. Safe exit. That's really nice. Very cool with all these safety features. I like that. Eco vehicle, coasting guide, start coasting. The cluster, you can choose the theme selection if you want to. Oh, look at that. That's pretty terrific. I'm digging this. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Again, a lot of different features that we could give the car. Lights. Ambient light. The color, it's on orchid green right now. How about sunrise red? Yeah, how about it, Jeff? I like it. So again, there's just so much you can do with this particular car, with the setup especially. I love it. Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, advanced voice recognition. Got the, I believe it's a dimming mirror. I'm, I'm almost positive that is. Lights, lights. Have the SOS button, as you'd expect, for safety. And then let's get over here for, ho, right there. It's a light. And it has the sliding function so you can cover the window. Let's take a minute to look at the visibility. Here we go. It's really good. Strong window space here. I'm just so impressed that we can get everything for the price that it is. I think that's a great deal. Look at that and it goes up just about all the way. Very nice. Are you impressed? The Elantra hybrid electric vehicle. Remember you get the blue trim level or you get the limited one. This is in fluid metal color with light gray interior. I love the combination. It looks fantastic. Look at this warranty. That is super strong and the advanced technology package. Wow. The safety, exterior, powertrain, and then look at all the multimedia features. You can just stop the video if you want to. Look on your own, maybe. Here we go. It starts at 29,450, 210 for carpet mats, 1150 for delivery, 30,800. That is pretty incredible. And yes, 50 miles a gallon, baby. Thanks for watching, everybody. What do you think about Elantra Hybrid? I'm really impressed with all the changes. There are so many different upgrades for 24 to make it a refreshment, a refreshed vehicle for the ages. I'm at Auto Jeff Reviews, Instagram, TikTok, YouTube, and Facebook. Thanks for helping me grow on all those platforms. You'll find fun and entertaining videos, growing library. Appreciate you being here. Thanks. Bye. And if you'd like more Hyundai content, click on the Hyundai playlist here. We've got Playlist broken down by brand. So if you want BMW, Nissan, Hyundai, Honda, Kia,
Toyota, Lexus, all those brands, Mercedes even. Check them out there on the playlist. Thanks guys for following Auto Jeff Reviews. Bye.